Welcome Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Today I will be doing your love reading for the remaining days of August 2021. I'll be taking a look at your person's energies. This can be anyone that you're thinking about dealing with or connecting with. Now Virgo, I know this is a different setting. This is only temporarily, okay? So let me just light up some sage here really quick. All right, Virgo, let's see. What does this person wish they can tell you at this time? God, angels, Holy Spirit, what does this person wish they can tell Virgo at this time, please? Okay. So I feel like this person respects you, Virgo. Only reason why I'm saying that is because under the deck, I did happen to see the respect card, okay? But the card that came out for you is I want to see you, okay? This person wants to see you. Maybe you haven't seen or talked to this person in quite some time now. But, yeah. Let's go ahead and take a further look here using the tarot deck. How is this person viewing Virgo at this time, please? God, angels, Holy Spirit. How is this person viewing Virgo at this time? Ace of Wands. Yeah, they want to see you. They want to have a new beginning with you. This might have been someone that... Either you were on and off with or someone that you lost contact with, okay? They want, they, they're viewing you as wanting to have a new beginning. Either you or this person wants to have a new beginning. Uh, this person may also be thinking about the times you guys were intimate, okay? Let's go ahead and clarify. They may have Aries, Leo, Sagittarius in their chart or you may. How is this person viewing Virgo? How is this person viewing Virgo? Grief. Yeah, this person is missing you. They're feeling some type of sadness here. Okay, grief. They want to come and offer you something. They've been thinking a lot. Ooh. Sorry, Virgo. Yeah, wow. This one fell on my lap. Return. Okay. But they've been contemplating a lot about you. They want to they want you to return or they may be viewing you as wanting to return to them. Okay? But I feel like this is more their energy of of, you know, Someone here has been thinking a lot about the other. They want to offer you. I'm hearing offer a new beginning. I keep hearing offer. I want to offer you a new beginning. Okay? Ooh, the sage is going wild here. Let me move this more over here. Okay. All right. Virgo. What is this person's feelings for Virgo, please? God, angels, Holy Spirit. What is this person's feelings? Ten of Swords. They're feeling betrayed. They're feeling backstabbed. Okay. They're feeling like this situation is over. Like, how could it just end like that? I'm hearing. Okay. They want to communicate because I feel like this person's hurting without you, Virgo. Okay. More Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. Could be a Gemini. Um... Libra Aquarius or a Taurus here. They want marriage with you. If you weren't married to this person, they want marriage with you. They want to communicate this with you, Virgo. What is this person's feelings for Virgo, please? God, angels, Holy Spirit. What is this person's feelings? Okay, I feel like this person has been doing a lot of work on themselves. They've been reinventing, like the reinvention card wanted to come out. So this person has been maybe trying to change their old habits, their old ways. Yeah, they've been missing you. Guys, this is pretty straightforward here. They've been stalking you possibly, observing you, looking at your social media or just looking at looking looking. <laughs> looking at your um looking at you at a distance here. They feel abandoned, but this person may be scared to contact you, Virgo. Okay, they've been feeling very nostalgic. Wow. I don't know if you can see here. Yeah. I do pick up the energy that this person has been observing you a lot. They have been very scared to approach you. Maybe this is why they haven't done so yet. All right. Let's move on here. What action does this person plan on taking towards Virgo? Ooh, Nine of Cups. You're their wish fulfillment. You're everything they've ever wanted, Virgo. Okay. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy. Give me one more. What action does this person plan on taking towards Virgo? Queen of Wands. Mm -hmm. I feel like you're, you're, I feel like the, 
the, the intimacy was very intense between you two. This person is very passionate about you. They want to come towards you with passion. Yeah. I, I see them taking action. And I feel like they're going to do it in a very nurturing way. In a very caring way. Okay. Like, hi Virgo. How you been? How's everything? Want to hang out, right? <laughs> what action does this person plan on taking towards Virgo? But there's a barrier. What's this barrier about? Give me one more. Oh, 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 there might be a child in the picture. Or maybe that somebody was acting childish. Maybe someone had addictions as well, I'm hearing. Yeah, this person's going to return. Yep. Yep, yep. reason why I say that is because, again, return came out. Now, there is a barrier here, okay? There is something. Now, leave, let me know in the comment box below, but there's something here that maybe is stopping you two from coming together again, or maybe there was a barrier in this connection. Maybe there was a child involved, um, or maybe somebody was acting very childish, okay? Or I'm also hearing that maybe someone got someone else pregnant or something like that, but... Regardless, this person does want to return. I see them returning, and I feel like they're going to do it very, either very passionately or very nurturing here. Okay, so do expect that here. You are this person's wish fulfillment, Virgo. What advice do you have for Virgo when it comes to this person? God, angels, Holy Spirit, remaining days of August 2021 in love. What advice do you have for Virgo when it comes to this person? Justice. Okay, make sure that things are fair. Make sure that things are equal. Maybe dealing with a Libra, okay? Ace of Cups. Wow. Oh, I'm sorry. Sorry, guys. My camera moved. Um, what advice do you have for Virgo? Give me one more card. Okay, angel, Holy Spirit. Wheel of Fortune. Okay, I see things. This is something that's gonna that's out of your your hands. Okay, Virgo, Wheel of Fortune, Destiny. Things, something's gonna happen here, or something. Maybe you may come together with this person again, or there's gonna be communication, or something. You might bump into this person. This is something that's out of your control. It's something that Destiny. Um, this is destined, okay? Something's about to happen that's destined. But your advice here is to, you know, make sure that you possibly speak your truths, especially if it has to do with a marriage, legal situation, or divorce. Uh, make sure the situation is balanced. And, I mean, the Ace of Cups is here, guys, okay? If this is something that's mutual, if both of you have love for each other, then have that new beginning in love, okay? This might be something that's destined here. A lot of you may be... Having new love coming your way as well. Possibly a Libra. I'm hearing Aries Leo Sagittarius. Okay. So, yeah. I feel like your advice here is to make sure things are fair. Things are equal. Speak the truth. I'm hearing speak the truth. And if this is not you, Virgo, then make sure the person speaking the truth. Because things need to come to a balance here. Things need to be fair. Justice here. And I feel like it will be played out because the Wheel of Fortune is here. Like the universe has your back. For what else is coming towards? <clears throat> For what else is coming towards Virgo? In love, remaining days of August 2021. God, angels, Holy Spirit. But this person wants to see you for sure. Not everything is lost. Something that you thought was lost for a lot of you Virgos is still not completely lost. And you have the King of Wands. Wow. Capricorn got this power couple here, okay? If you have fire in your chart and you meet someone who has fire in, um, what's it called? Uh, what's it called? If both of you have fire in your chart, then just be, pay attention to that because it might be a power couple, might be some type of soulmate energy, okay? But for those of you who are single, I feel like there might be something that is not completely lost for you, okay? You may be feeling like, um, okay, for some of you, you may have lost hope in love. Don't lose hope and love because I feel like there's still two options here that you're not even seeing or pay attention to. Okay, look around your surroundings, Virgo. There's a lot of people that are interested in you, I'm hearing. Um, might be, and also you may be meeting a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. I see you meeting this person maybe when you're possibly traveling or when you're out celebrating something, okay, or at a, at a party, family party, gathering with friends, an event, work event, some type of concert, festival, something around those lines here. And, or travel, like I mentioned earlier. But yeah, but for others of you, there might be something from your past past that is not fully, completely lost. But I feel like you're, you're not, 
you know, regardless, if you're not interested in the past, that's fine. Like I said, I see new opportunities here for you, but I, you need to be more open. You need to uh, look around, look around, because there's there's people that are like you. There's people that see you very attractive, very, very sexy here, Virgo, okay? But I think you're not noticing, maybe because you have been stuck in the past or you have given up in love. So, yeah, that's just for some of you here. But again, if this didn't resonate, feel free to check your other placements, Virgo. Thank you so much for those who have joined my channel. It means so much to me. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and I will see you soon. Bye-bye.